Hi friends, happy Monday. So let's see, Monday library updates. Last week I finally, it took me forever, got done with all of the breakout EDUs, the digital ones. So they are posted on your Google Classrooms under the library subject, or the, they are also linked on the library symbols as well. And um, it says, I think it just says breakouts on them. So you can click on any one you want. They're organized by subject. And if you're finding one grade level too hard, back up a grade level. Um, since they're on the symbols, you can do any grade level that you want to. So you just go in, you click on it, and then you basically break the locks digitally. You can skip around on the locks. You do not have to do them in order. Um, look for clues like things that'll show you what comes first and second and that sort of thing. Um, numbers a lot of times that will show you that. The more you do them, the, the more it'll start to be easier for you. But they're good. They're a good brain teaser, so you should try them. Um, what was the other thing? Oh, Flipgrid. So I've got a bunch of friends who have shared either what they're reading or um, have read me a chapter of a book, which is awesome. So I hope you guys will go on and check that out. Um, it's on flipgrid.com, Brew Library. I have that also linked in your Google Classrooms as well. And um, the, the really cool stuff, so it's been really nice. I'm going to continue with my new read aloud this week for fourth, third and fourth grade called Shine. And there's gonna be a special activity with that. Chris Grabenstein is actually doing a virtual author visit not this week, but next week, so I'm going to post about that. Fifth grade, we're going to keep reading, and I'm going to do another read aloud or two for my younger grades as well. Um, I think that is about it. Oh, I'm also going to post that about the Magic Treehouse um, thing I talked about last week, too. They're all new updated game site that you can use. All right, so see you, friends. Stay well.